Okay, welcome to the first real tutorial in Microsoft Visual Basic 2008 Express Edition. I'll be teaching you how to create a Hello World application which will simply send a message to the user saying Hello World. Okay, the first thing you need to do is go to File, New Project, make sure it's on Windows Forms Application, just name project anything you like. My first application. Okay. Okay, and the way we're going to do this is we're going to use a button, which is one of the tools in Visual Basic. A button can be used to can be used to activate, oh, can be used to create an event. So if you click a button, it, uh, some code will execute. So we're going to use this to execute our hello world. So you click on the button and over on the right you notice properties. Scroll down to the bottom which says button one in text. Change that to click me. You can also play around with the properties like the colour and the flat style if you like, but for this I'm just gonna leave it. Okay, now once you have that, you need to double click the button. Now when you double click the button, that means it's gonna you're going to enter the code that's going to execute when you click that button. If you see here, private sub button one underscore click, and at the end it says handles button one dot click. So in between private sub here and end sub, this is going to be our code. Okay, to start off your code to show a message box, you simply type message, but message box, oh, message box dot show. Now once you've done this, it's it's gonna you're gonna add two parentheses or put two quotations as well because strings need to be in quotations, and then you're gonna put what the message box is gonna say. Who we're gonna say hello world, and all this is gonna do is when you click button one, it's going to message box, show message box saying hello world. So to test out your application at the top here with the green button, click it. And then where it says here click me, hello world. That's how to create a simple message box application in Visual Basic. There's also other parentheses you can use, like you can have a title. message box title we'll play that and if you see here message box title and hello world and you can also choose your message box icons and your message box buttons from the parentheses but that's going to be in a later tutorial okay so just please comment with your questions suggestions or even if you would like a tutorial made comment with what you would like any requests and please rate the video, if even if you want to rate it one star, it's your opinion. And subscribe to the channel for more tutorials.